A case against a Hancock man accused of causing the death of his infant son is moving forward. 27-year-old Benjamin Riley waived his preliminary hearing in 97 District Court and was bound over to Circuit Court. In July, police say Riley gave his child an alcoholic beverage and then placed him in an unsafe sleeping environment. Riley is facing a charge of involuntary manslaughter, a 15-year felony, along with two charges of child abuse, both 10-year felonies. He is also facing four other felonies stemming from an alleged theft on the campus of Finlandia University. They include breaking and entering with intent, a 10-year felony, two 5-year felonies, receiving and concealing stolen property and fleeing and eluding a police officer, and making a false report of a felony, which itself is a 4-year felony. Also headed to circuit court in an unrelated case is 26-year-old Nicholas Edwards. The Hancock man is facing a counterfeiting charge after being arrested when police searched a residence and found a large amount of counterfeit money. A local business had complained after receiving some of the fake money. Edwards could get up to life in prison if convicted. He signed a revocable waiver of his preliminary hearing in district court as a resolution in the case could be reached with the prosecutor before Edwards appears for his arraignment. Both suspects are currently lodged in the Houghton County Jail. For ABC 10 CW5 News, I'm Cuban Bureau reporter Rick Allen.